to be transparent. You know, I have been accused by the so-called community of cryptocurrency. She is violating the philosophy of cryptocurrency. Sounds very spectacular, I'm violating the philosophy. So what is the philosophy of cryptocurrency? Cryptocurrency has to be anonymous. To be very honest with you, I don't think so. So somebody came into our support team at Telegram and tells us that he cannot get his account KYC verified. And therefore, ever since he invested, he cannot transact his assets from his account to another account or actually use Dell Shaker platform to purchase anything online. This, however, tells me how fake this company is because <laughs> she didn't just leave a fake company behind, but he actually left no technology behind. Nothing that can actually automatically approve KYC system. So what kind of a billion company is this? I mean, 4 billion euros corrected, but you cannot even auto approve KYC documents. I mean, what kind of nonsense is this? What kind of a serious company takes six months without verifying customer documents? What kind of company is this? Ladies and gentlemen, we ain't haters, but they are visible proof that actually every person can actually see. Even the brain can actually see. She didn't create a cryptocurrency, but she created a pyramid scheme to actually take people's money with fake promises and after run away. Everybody can see this. I mean, people invested in their money, not that they cannot even be KYC approved. However, <laughs> we must all know that there is rumor which says that actually one coin did not just scam people but actually one coin also sells kyc documents to black markets and dark websites so meaning that your uh, passport documents your national id documents your driver's license documents are also being sold that they are also being sold. I don't have proof on that, but there are rumors that there is high possibility that actually KYC documents are actually being sold to black markets and dark websites and they are being paid. I think it's, it's got something like $15 per document. Yes, $15 per document or even more. If you start comparing with documents from those uh, actually already developed countries, then the price but document must be really, 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 really very high. So there is a, a possibility that actually even your bank details are not secure. So I wonder if this lady will actually scam people <laughs> mentally and also physically using their documents. So that is what is actually happening with one coin. KYC documents, KYC approving actually the systems are not working fine i wonder if they still have support system because if actually the customer couldn't contact the one coin support system and he was actually looking for anybody anywhere possible so he was just moving on facebook social media telegram until he reached on one coin support group and he thought that maybe we are the one coin administrators no we are just one coin victim support team that actually give support to one coin victims who feel that they were actually scammed and we simply give out free support system you can always get us on telegram click in the description below to find the telegram link and also join the conversation always follow me on twitter you can always support me on patreon that is www.patreon slash daniel and also on coin tree for crypto donations bye for now and wait for my next video dr ruja still scamming the world and actually some few people still believe and many people we have turned them and they now know the truth